Welcome to Jamming Classics. Today we have a really special show for all of you to see. Veronica, Brianna, are you girls ready to go? Yeah, yeah let's, let's go. go. Let's go. So we're here in Albuquerque, New Mexico for their annual car show and balloon festival. Lots of great cars, lots of balloons. You're gonna see some flying pigs and some flying cows. So let's go check it out. Now first to give you a brief history, it was back in 1783 that two French brothers invented hot air ballooning, the world's oldest aviation sport. The brothers, Jacques and Joseph Montgolfier, were local paper manufacturers and they noticed that when they burnt paper, the ashes floated into the air. They believed that the heat and smoke had a special lifting quality and set their minds to inventing a craft that could capture smoke and heat to lift it off the ground. It was on September 19, 1783, that they successfully launched a balloon made from paper and cloth. Now the brothers were too nervous to try out their invention themselves, so they sent up a sheep, a duck, and a rooster to see what would happen. Well, the paper balloon floated up into the sky and landed safely with the animals after eight minutes in the air. Then, on November 21st, 1783 in Paris, with King Louis XVI present, the hot air balloon was again launched for all to see there in Paris. Now this time on board were two friends of the Montgolfier brothers, Pilatre de Rosier and Francois Lunier. The modern word pilot comes from Pilatre de Rosier's name. This balloon was successfully launched and rose 500 feet above the rooftops of Paris and it landed a few miles away in some vineyards. As it landed, the local farmers raced towards the balloon, now with their pitchforks ready to attack this strange object from the sky. Now to prevent the farmers from destroying the balloon, Delatre and Francois offered them a bottle of champagne as thanks for allowing them to land in their field. Now today in memory of that first courageous flight, champagne is often drunk after a hot air balloon ride. Now, the balloon fiesta started here in Albuquerque, New Mexico in 1972 when a small gathering of 13 balloons launched from a mall parking lot here. And the balloon fiesta has since grown to be the world's largest balloon event. Every year now, during the first week of October, brings out thousands of guests to experience a nine-day extravaganza of color and excitement with over 600 balloons, 400 classic vehicles, and a thousand pilots on this custom 365 acre balloon fiesta park. If on your way to the balloon fiesta and cruising through Vegas, you won't miss that famous landmark balloon on the strip in front of the Paris Hotel and Casino. It is a replica of the original balloon launched by the Montgolfier brothers in 1783. If you decide to go dancing at the Chateau there at the Paris Casino, be sure to catch a glimpse of the balloon at night from the balcony of the nightclub. This balloon is a fitting tribute and a glorious sight to see day or night. At the event in Albuquerque, Guests are welcome to walk the field and be part of the action. Now when getting started, remember, hot air weighs less than cold air. As the air is heated inside the balloon, the heated air rises. As the air inside the balloon cools, it descends. The inside of the balloon is called the envelope. The material that is used for the balloon envelope is ripstop nylon or polyester with tough, durable coatings for heat and air retention. Many of the balloons here were made by Cameron balloons, 
owned by Don Cameron in Bristol, England. They are the world's largest balloon maker. In the past 30 years, they have built over 6,000 balloons in all shapes and sizes and experiences everything when putting together a complex balloon, such as the Disney Castle and the Space Shuttle balloons. In 1999, it was a Cameron balloon first to fly around the world. Now to inflate a balloon, an inflator fan fills it with cold air. The air is then heated with a burner. The burner is fueled by a 20 to 45 gallon propane tank that is carried on the floor of the basket called the gondola. The gondola is made of wicker that is strong and flexible. When the valves are opened on the propane tank, the propane vaporizes and is ignited by a pilot light in the burner. The flame may shoot out as much as 10 to 20 feet. The ideal time to fly a balloon is in the morning when the air is cool with lower winds because the balloon travels the direction of the wind current. In 1997, the New Mexico Rainbow Roadrunners Car Club was formed and in 2000 held the first annual Fiesta of Wheels car show here with over 300 classic cars. This annual event brings out hundreds of classic, vintage and special interest vehicles from New Mexico and around the country. In 1793, President George Washington observed the first North American balloon flight. And in 1960, a record was set for the highest parachute jump from a balloon by Air Force Captain Joe Kittinger, who jumped from a balloon 102,800 feet and on the way down, broke the sound barrier with his body. In 2005, Bob Bourbon and Benoit Simeons of Belgium traveled 2,112 miles from here in Albuquerque to Quebec province in Canada, setting a new world distance record. Then in 1979, another exciting event called the Balloon Glow was started here in Albuquerque when local pilots inflated their balloons on Christmas Eve to all of the residents here as a thank you. The evening glow balloons are breathtaking to watch as they appear as giant Christmas ornaments. And in 1987, Albuquerque then launched the first and the world's largest balloon glow that is now one of Balloon Fiesta's most popular events. Let's watch and enjoy some of the wonderful moments here at this Balloon Fiesta.
Now, many of the balloonists recite the balloonist prayer prior to a flight. This centuries-old prayer has been recited by many of the balloonists and they believe it has kept them safe on their journeys in the sky, as well as keeping them safe as they return back to Mother Earth. We hope you enjoyed the show. Remember, if you need more information, go to jamandclassics.com and we will see you there. there. Number